Hello everybody, so today I'm going to be showing you how to prepare a package file for City Car Driving, the mod installer by Damon, which if you look down to my taskbar, I have right there. Now first of all, you're going to need to make a new folder uh, in your own location, and just title it whatever. And I'm going to be making a PKG file for the BMW X5 F15 fix. Now you're going to want to make a folder called Zero. This contains all of the uh, files necessary that will be extracted to your um to your game and um make them make them um in number order for the different extras that you have so for example if i just wanted to add an extra i'd make a folder called one and put everything that is in the extra into the folder so in this zero folder you're going to have your data and export folders and now you'll either have in data you'll have game data cars and then this and then the folder of the car name Keep in mind you're also going to need to use some of the original files from the car. And uh, in data, and then um, sometimes you'll have an audio folder. To know that if you need the audio folder, go into car property, the I and I, and check to see what sound bank name. So I do not need one because it says Oyota, which is one of the default ones. Now so I'll go ahead and close out of that. And so you're also going to need physics, and then cars, engine, and transmission which should just contain this so it should look like this and now once you have that prepared you can pause the video at any time this is the important part you're going to need to download a file from the description which is uh, called modparameters.ini now we're going to go ahead and paste it this is i'm going to uh, have placeholders for it but this is the one from the Mitsubishi Lancer by Dennis154RUS now right here in this mod parameters file this is the one that will show up in the Russian version of the game this is the English version of the game now to do so we're going to need to paste in the car properties or the player cars dot xml file which is located in data config and then it, it is titled player cars dot xml now just go ahead and uh, paste in line by line what it is this is what mine is. Oops. Just the Audi S4 one. Okay, let's go ahead and uh if you can't find it, just control F BMW. X5 E70, X5 M M5 M5. Here it is. Okay, so here's ours. So you want to go line by line pasting this into it. So I'd recommend starting from that edge of the line so that that way you don't have any extra spaces. So just the first line, line by line. Make sure you're pasting it inside of these uh, mini quotes. Like so. Just like this. Should look just like this. Now just keep pasting it in line by line. I'm going to pause it until I finish so you can see what it looks like. We're back. So I finished pasting in the entire player cars into the first one. And if you have more lines than just the 11, then all you need to do is add um, more lines in between where you need it. As long as uh, it's in quotes like this, like it is right now, and you have this code after it, and at CRLF, it should be fine. After you're done with that, you're just going to want to copy these, like this, paste them down into the English section like a so paste so as you can see everything's good now what you need to do is we don't we don't have any extras so just delete all this I'm gonna be sending you guys the file that I'm creating as you speak as I speak as I talk to you now I'm using notepad plus plus to edit this so now the stock description I'm going to want to uh, change this to just stock, meaning you have the stock installed, just like that. Now, make if you want a README file, I am going to make one. Go to New Text Document, call it README, or whatever you want to call it, and say, Nope, I can't open stuff in Notepad until I connect my second monitor, so we're just gonna edit it with Notepad and just say, This fix was made in a video okay go ahead and save that and now in back in crap I closed out of notepad plus plus didn't I here we are okay did we save we saved yay okay now uh, read me it's called 
read me. Now, go ahead and put in your VK ID if you have one here. Just name this David. Let's put in my VK ID city card. Driving. Mod author, put in the mod authors. Mine be love. RS69. Car name in the GUI. BMW X5 F15. For traffic. If you if it's not a traffic car, don't put anything there. But if it is a player car, put it there. Now, if it is a traffic car, put the traffic car code here. Make sure to end it with this. And put it in quotes. Now, now from here, you take this. Now for folder to Dell, traffic code to Dell, player card to Dell, you're going to want to go ahead and copy this from the player cars, paste it in here. So just like this. Paste. Paste. And paste. And so now, um, mod is for 133. The mod version for this one, this would be it's 0 0.99 right now. So we're going to set this as 1.0 for player. So it's just for the player. Made in 133. So, stock description. You're just going to want to change both of these to stock. Unless you want some Russian. So, I think we're done, eh? Well, alright. So now we're going to go ahead and save it. Save that mod parameters. Now here comes one of the easier parts. I'm going to go ahead and press add to archive. And make sure it's an RAR. Just like that. And we'll just let this do its thing. WinRAR is definitely... WinRAR is probably needed. Now go ahead and uh, click that. Rename it so at the end it says PKG and since it's an X5 put it X5 F15 we'll do a PKG 15 file. Press yes. Now to test to make sure that the fix works and you have all the files needed Go ahead and uninstall the original one. This is how you know if you're going to need to have the other one installed. And then go ahead and put in the new one. So as you can see, still the new one, but now, now it says 1.0. We take a look at the old one. This is how we know that it is different. And I capitalized X and F. So I fixed some stuff. Or in my opinion, I fixed it. So go ahead and run your package file. And this is how you know if you're going to need to have the original mod installed. Click install mod. So this will take a while. Installation successful. So now we're going to go ahead and uninstall this. Should uninstall the entire mod, but just to be sure. We're also going to uninstall the original. So BMX x5.pkg5 is the original. Okay. okay. So now we're going to. So here's how to find out if you need to have the original mod installed is open it up without the original mod installed. Go ahead and install it. Now I'm going to get grab you guys a screenshot of the error that you'll get if you do. If you do need to, um. If you guys need to, um. You guys need to install the original mod. You'll get an error that looks like this: an error has occurred while copying a mod's files, or the mod is corrupted. Make sure the installer is running as administrator, not blocked by antivirus, and then try again. If you get that error, just install the um, original original mod. And so now we should be good to go. Thank you for watching. And my voice cracked. Bye.